Sergio Venegas, please go ahead. Thank you very much. How are you today, coach? How are you doing? I'm perfectly. Thank you very much. Take our time to, to give us a little time of your, your day. This is Sergio Venegas, live from Mexico City for theportrese.com. So what are your thoughts? Because the United States just give you the chance of their stars, give you some time off, if you want to say like that, for your stars. And you get through to this instance so easily with a good game. What do you expect tomorrow, the game against uh, Jamaica? And I wish you good luck and see you maybe in the next round. Thank you very much, coach. I think it'll be a difficult game. Um, you know, we're, we're happy with how our group has performed, um, but we know Jamaica is a good team. We know all the teams left in the tournament are good teams and we're, we're going to have to play a good game. Um, it's a physical team. Uh, you know, they got a very strong group in here. Uh, it's a team that made the final qualifying round with this group. So, you know, we, we know it's not going to be easy. Uh, but we're looking forward to it also. This is an opportunity for our guys to gain experience in, in a competitive knockout stage of a tournament, and um, we're welcoming it. Uh, the group is ready and prepared. You know, the way we look at this is we have one, one player pool that we're preparing for World Cup qualifying, and, um, you know, you only have a certain amount of games to do so. With the Nations League, we had two games. Here we have a potential of six games. Uh, we're able to add a fr two friendlies on the back end of uh, front and back end of Nations League to make that four games. So in, in total, we had 10, di 10 di uh, games to prepare the, the entire player pool for World Cup qualifying. And this is the route we chose. I wouldn't look at it the way you described it. I would look at it as these are young players. Um, our whole player pool is young um, and we're trying to get them experience. And games like tomorrow are, are what does it. What I can tell you about Jamaica, it's going to be a physical team. They're going to be up for the game. They have a skillful team, good group of players. Um, you know, it's basically as good as it gets for Jamaica right now. And it's, it's going to be a tough test for us. And our, our job is to, you know, to try to hurt them in ways that we hurt teams and, um, and not give up goals and hopefully score more goals than they do. Well, you, you look at it as a potential for 120 minutes. Um, you have to be calm. You have time in the game. Um, you know, it's about responding to, to moments, not reacting to moments, and being cool and keeping your composure. I think that's the, that's the message. We have a game. We have a game plan. We know our game model, and we want to go out and execute it. And at times, you know, we could expect it to be working great, and then the times it's not working, it's okay. How do we get back on track? And how are we working collectively? Um, to win the game. You know, one thing we know about all these games is the margins are very small. You know, when you look at the knockout rounds, it, it's usually very tight games. And, and for us, it's about, um, you know, being focused on every single play. 